Keeping your sync system updated is simple. Let me explain. First, open a browser on your computer and go to SyncMyRide.com. If you already have a sync account, log in here. Or you can use your login and password from your Ford owner account. If you don't have either type of account, you'll need to register for one. Okay, now you're ready to start. Once you've logged in, you'll be directed to the vehicle to-do list page, where it will tell you if a sync software update is available for your vehicle. Click get update, then the download sync update button. You'll be instructed that you'll need an empty USB drive that holds at least two gigabytes of data and is not password protected. Now, click start download process. Once your download is complete, connect your USB and move the files to it. To do so, find the zip file on your computer's hard drive and unzip it. Then, drag all the files onto your USB drive. Remove the USB and take it with you so you can install the updates in your vehicle. Keep in mind, if you don't unzip the file, Sync will not recognize it. Once you're in your car, the update will take a few steps. Turn on your vehicle and your radio and plug in the USB drive. Press the Begin Software Installation bar on your screen. Sync will talk to you to let you know that it is about to begin. And you'll see a message telling you that the update may take up to 30 minutes to complete. Press the OK button on that screen to let Sync know you are ready to begin. Your system will reboot and a progress bar will come up on your screen. Once this segment is done, you'll see a series of messages, dark screens, and status bars that repeat several times while your system is rebooting and updating. Don't worry, this is normal. You'll see the home screen briefly, a progress bar, and then a message that you have successfully updated your Sync software, with a reminder to visit SyncMyRide.com to confirm that your install was successful. Press OK to continue, and when you see the installation complete message, press OK and remove your USB. Now, you'll need to report your software update installation on SyncMyRide.com. Connect your USB drive to your computer, then click Report Update and follow the instructions on the screen on how to upload your file. After your file is uploaded, you'll see an Update Successful message. Click OK and then remove your USB. This way, Ford Motor Company will have a record of the current sync version installed in your vehicle and can send you updates and applications specific to your system. You can also keep track of the latest installations on the vehicle to-do list page of the website. Of course, if you're having trouble with your updates or would rather not do them yourself, you can always visit your dealer. Any questions? Go to SyncMyRide.com.